In this video, I'll show you how to change your fees and your slippage on Axiom Pro. If you find this video helpful, don't forget to subscribe and like the video. So the first thing that you're going to need to do is obviously log into your Axiom Pro account. If you don't already have an Axiom Pro account, I'll drop a link down below in the description and the pinned comment that will get you a 10% discount on your trading fees. Once you click on that link, you're going to come to a page that looks like this, and you're going to go right over here and click on Start Trading and sign up for an account using your email. Gmail, or your fan wallet. Make sure that key shows up right over here under the invite code. That'll make sure that you get the discount on your trading fees. After you've logged into your account, you're gonna to come to a page that looks like this, and you can either go right over here to your settings, or if you're in the Pulse tab, again, you just go right over here, click on preset settings, and this is where you can change your fees and your slippage. You also have three different set of presets that you can fill out for different trading styles. If you're going for something with high volume and high volatility, you're going to go and go over here, go to your buy settings and your slippage. 20% is a pretty good average. And right here for the priority fee, if you look right down here at the bottom, you're going to see gas and bribe. This is the recommended fees that Axiom suggests you should be having on for trading. So if you want to go with the recommended fees right over here, you want 0.002 for your priority. So we just change that right here. And for your bribe fee, and just change the 0 0.01. So we can just do that. And now for the sell settings, we can put them the exact same 0 0.01 and 0 0.02. And for sell settings, your slippage, you kind of want to have it at a higher number, just in case the coin dumps, you want to get out of there with as much of your money as possible. If your slippage is only at 10% and it drops lower than 10%, you're not going to get filled and you're not going to get out of that trade. So now let's say that you're not trading anything with a lot of volatility and not a lot of volume. You can get away with lower priority and bribe fees. You can experiment with this. But for example, if you want to trade with 0 0.009 priority, and 0 0.001 bribe. Same with your cell settings. You can do that. You can also turn MEV reduction on or off. And basically having that on will just prevent you from getting front run. And now for your quick buy or if you're sniping and you want to change those settings, you're going to go right over here to your snipe settings. Click on that. And you can just adjust these however you want. You can have your MEV reduction on or off. It's recommended to have MEV reduction on, especially if you want a better fill. But if you're trading with a small portfolio, you don't really need to waste more money on fees. And that's basically it. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to subscribe and like the video.